हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू योग बेला आई एम प्रीति आई नो कल आप लोगों की प्रैक्टिस बहुत ही अच्छी रही है कुछ लोगों ने 27 सेवन राउंड्स ऑफ सूर्य नमस्कार कंप्लीट करे हैं एंड कुछ लोगों ने कंप्लीट नहीं करे हैं तो जिन्होंने कंप्लीट नहीं करे हैं मैं आपको बता दूं ये बस एक माइंड गेम है जाके एक और अटैम्प्ट देना आई एम श्योर आप लोग कंप्लीट कर लोगे एंड आज हम लोग प्रैक्टिस करने वाले हैं योगा फॉर स्ट्रेंथ मेनली हम लोग काम करेंगे आपके लेग्स पर क्वाड्स योर कोर स्ट्रेंथ एंड योर आर्म स्ट्रेंथ जो लोग फर्स्ट टाइम इस टाइप की क्लासेस कर रहे हैं मेरे साथ मैं उनको ये बताना चाहती हूँ आपको बिल्कुल रियल क्लास जैसा एक्सपीरियंस मिलेगा पॉजेज एंड ब्रेक्स बिल्कुल रियल क्लास की तरह होंगे आपको बस मेरे साथ एंड मेरे इंस्ट्रक्शन के साथ फ्लो करना है दैट्स ऑल एक चीज़ का ध्यान रखना आप लोग क्विट नहीं करोगे क्लास बीच में एनी पॉइंट आपको लगे थोड़ा ज़्यादा हो रहा है टेक अ ब्रेक टेक अ पॉज एंड देन अगेन गेट बैक टू योर मैट सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट Sit comfortably. Make sure your spine is uplifted, shoulders completely relaxed. We'll start with Om Chants. Join your palms to the chest center. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out completely. Inhale for the Om Chant. gentle blinks open your eyes namaste slowly onto your force keep your fingers wide open wrist comes right under your shoulder knees hip width apart tuck your toes now slowly take your knees an inch off and breathe one two three entire weight is on your palms and your tugged toes four and five drop down catch your breath second round tugged toes slowly take your knees off just an inch off one two three four and five gently drop now walk your palms slightly forward tuck your toes take your knees off downward facing dog downward facing dog you can keep your knees bent or you can take your heels off one by one just to find the length in your spine you can bend your knees this is your first downward facing dog find that length in your spine make sure in downward facing dog your fingers always wide open and your center finger pointing forward weight is equally distributed on four limbs your palms and your feet gaze at your knees or at your navel Now gently bring your right foot forward in between your palms. We'll go for high lunge. Slowly lift your chest up, hands at your waist. Once you are comfortable, extend your arms up. 
breathe there. One, two, three, four, and five. Exhale, palms down, right leg back, downward facing dog. Now gently bring your left foot forward in between your palms. High lunge on your left side. Chest up. Hands at your waist. Extend your arms up. Breathe. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Palms down. Left leg back. Downward facing dog. Now, gently bring your right foot forward in between your palms and your left foot forward. Hands at your waist. Look forward. Slowly come up with an inhalation. Slowly come up. We'll go for three rounds of Surya Namaskar with some variations. Feet together. Join your palms to the chest center. Now slowly extend your arms up. Bend your knees slightly, push your hips forward, bend back. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, right leg back. Gaze forward. Exhale, left leg back. We'll hold plank for 10 deep breaths. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Drop your knees down, chest down, and chin down. Ashtang. Inhale, scoop up. Exhale, hip up. Now, bring your right foot forward in between your palms. Gaze forward. Exhale, left foot forward. And now, slowly extend your arms forward. Upper body parallel to the floor. Slowly come up. Knees bent, hips forward, bend back. Exhale, bend forward. Now the left side. Inhale, left leg back. Exhale, right. And hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine ten drop your knees down chest down and chin down ashtang inhale scoop up exhale hip up bring your left foot forward in between your palms gaze forward exhale right forward Knees slightly bent, extend your arms forward, upper body parallel to the floor. Slowly come up, push your hips forward, bend back. Exhale, palms to the chest center. Second round. Inhale, hast Uthana. Knees bent, hips forward, bend back. Exhale, Pada Hastasana. Inhale, right leg back. Ashwa Sanjalan. Exhale, left leg back. Now in this round, the variation we'll do is baby push-up. You can drop your knees down. Also interlock your shin. Now, with an exhalation, you have to bend your elbows and go down. So first inhale. 
exhale down inhale up exhale down five rounds of this if you are very comfortable in this one then you can go for full push ups like this one exhale inhale exhale inhale you can do this one we'll go for five reps inhale exhale one inhale back exhale two inhale back exhale three inhale back exhale four inhale back exhale five inhale back back to plank now knees down chest down and chin down ashtanga inhale scoop up bhujanga exhale hip up parvatasana inhale right foot forward in between your palms exhale left foot forward bend forward slowly come up knees slightly bent extend your arms forward come up push your hips forward bend back exhale pada hastasana gently take your left leg back and your right and baby push up or the full one whatever suits you inhale exhale one inhale back exhale two inhale back exhale three inhale back exhale four inhale back exhale five inhale back plank knees down chest down and chin down ashtang inhale scoop up bhujanga exhale hip up parvatas now bring your left foot forward in between your palms exhale right full forward bend now slowly come up knees bent hips forward exhale palms to the chest center now the last one round 3 feet together palms to the chest center inhale extend your arms up knees bent hips forward bend back exhale bend forward inhale right leg back exhale left leg back knees chest and chin down inhale scoop up exhale hip up now feet together and take your right leg up to the ceiling one two three try keeping your hip square make sure you don't open it like this keep it square four and five bring your right foot forward in between your palms knee ankle in one line just make sure put your back heel down from here we are going for warrior 1 now back foot down slowly hands at your waist lift your chest up extend your arms up very comfortable look up and breathe 1 2 3 4 4 and 5 hands at your waist open your hips warrior 2 hip square shoulder square right knee ankle in one line right thigh approximately parallel to the floor 
arms at shoulder level, gaze at your right center finger and breathe. One, two, three, four, and five. Right forearm on your right thigh, your left arm over your head. Pashyokona variation. Breathe there. Gaze at your left fingers or simply up to the ceiling. One. So by now your right thigh should be burning. Two. Hold it there. Feel that fire. Three. Four. And five. Look down. Palms down. Now take your left heel off and bring your left foot forward. Bend forward. You can place your palms behind your shin going deeper in the forward bend. Now slowly knees bend. Extend your arms forward, slowly come up, knees bent, hips forward, bend back. Exhale, bend forward. Slowly take your left leg back and your right back. Knees down, chest down and chin down. Ashtang. Inhale, scoop up. Bhujanga. Exhale, hip up. Parvatasana. Now, feet together. Take your left leg up to the ceiling. Breathe. Keep your hips square and breathe. One, two, three, four, and five. Bring your left foot forward in between your palms. Now, put your Back heel down for warrior one. Now slowly hands at your waist, lift your chest up. Extend your arms up. Breathe. Very comfortable, look up at the root of your thumb. Back foot grounded. One. Hip square facing the front. Just make sure of that. Two. Three, four, and five. Hands at your waist. Open your hip to the right side. Sink down. Hip, shoulders in one line. Arms at shoulder level. Pelvis slightly tucked. Gaze at your left center finger. Breathe there. One, two, three, four, and five. Left forearm down on your left thigh, your right arm over your head. Look up to the ceiling, breathe there. One, your left thigh should be burning now. Three, four, feel that fire within. And five, look down at your left toes, palms down, right heel off, you are onto your right toes and slowly bring your right foot forward. Now, Place your palms behind your shin, knees slightly bent, keep your feet slightly apart, knees bent, abdomen in touch with your thighs, place your palms behind your shin and go deeper in the forward bend. With every exhalation, as I always tell you, with every exhalation pull your abdomen in, create space and go deeper in the forward bend. You can consciously Draw your navel in, take it towards your spine and go deeper in the forward bend. Now 
now feet together knees bent extend your arms up slowly come up push your hips forward exhale palms to the chest center release your hands and spread your legs wide just for a moment observe your breath lengthen your breath deepen your breath slowly bring your feet together and set your waist take your left leg back turn your right toes in distance between your feet is around 3 feet turn your toes to 45 degree ab hum jo pose karne wale hain it's a goddess pose slowly bend your knees make sure your knees and ankle is in one line your pelvis slightly tucked so your back should be straight comfortable palms to the chest center this is goddess pose Just make sure you are breathing power breathing here one two stay three four and five stay there upper body down place your left forearm on your left thigh your right palm on your right knee push your right knee out to the right side and twist to the left look up to the ceiling breathe there and nicely push it out one to you should feel the stretch in your right inner thigh four and five change the other side your right forearm on your right thigh with your left hand push your left knee out look up to the ceiling feel the stretch in your left inner thigh one two Three, four, and five. Center. Straighten your legs. Turn your toes in. Next posture is Prasarita Padottan. Grab your big toes directly with your three finger grip, thumb, index finger, and center finger. Inhale. Lengthen your spine. exhale bend forward one two three four and five inhale look up exhale out completely and now place your palms down turn your right toes to the right side and send your right leg back drop your knees down sit back swing your legs forward we'll go for janu shirshasana bend your right knee drop your right knee to the right side okay main aapko bata deti hu kaisa dikhne wala hai janu shirshasana this is how it looks like but i'll do on my right first bend your right knee drop your right knee to the right side take your right heel as high as you can closer to the groins this is the right angle 90 degree here grab your left foot i mean wherever you can reach ankle shin wherever it's completely fine inhale lengthen your spine 
exhale bend forward idea is to feel the stretch in the back of your left leg two very comfortable use your right hand to grab your right wrist and focus more on taking your chin closer to the shin rather than rounding your back and going down like this focus more on lengthening your spine taking your chin closer to the shin breathe there and toes slightly flex towards you three four and five inhale look up exhale release and now slowly keeping the same position of your legs take your right hand back place it behind your right hip watch it very nicely then attempt it right hand back behind your right hip and now left hand is off the floor press your palm into the ground and lift your buttocks off it's a mild back bend breathe there one two three four and five sit back now the next position keeping your legs still same the third posture left knee pointing up it's a twist here now with your right hand grab the outer edge of left foot and straighten not able to straighten keep it bent it's absolutely fine place your left hand back and straighten your left leg once you are very comfortable look back you are still comfortable release your left hand back look at your left thumb and breathe one two three four and five release now release your right leg and bend your left we'll go for janushirshasana first take your left heel closer to the groins right angle grabbing your right foot inhale lengthen exhale bend forward this time if you're very comfortable with your left hand grab the wrist off grab your right wrist exhaling bend forward breathe there gaze at your big toe one two with every exhalation you are working on going deeper in the forward bend don't just stick to this position one position and taking five deep breaths there every time with every exhalation idea is to go deeper in the forward bend three four and five inhale look up exhale out completely and release now this time place your left hand back and now extend your right arm up press your left palm into the ground and take your hips off breathe there one two three four and five slowly get back now we'll go for a twist here right knee pointing up with your left hand grab the outer edge of right foot slowly lean back straighten place your right hand back if you're very comfortable release your right hand as well look at your right thumb one two feel the twist three four and five gently release now release your legs forward 
lie down on your spine. Shavasana. Before Shavasana, just hug your knees to the chest to release all the tension from your lower back. Now release your legs in Shavasana. Spread your legs wide, toes falling either side of the body. Palms facing up to the ceiling, fingers naturally curled. Allow your armpits also to breathe. body is completely relaxed now. Simply observe your breath. With every inhalation, feel the expansion of your abdomen. With every exhalation, your abdomen is sinking down into the mat. Observe this abdominal movement while breathing. Gently bring your awareness back to the body. Gentle movement in your fingers and your toes. Slowly move your head left, right. Bringing your feet together, extend your arms up over your head, interlock your fingers, give a nice stretch from top to toes. Bend your left knee, rolling onto the right side. The moment you feel comfortable, sit up in Sukhasan, keeping your eyes closed. Take a moment to acknowledge the experience of last practice. Observe the change in your mind, which has come after the practice. Check your breath. Has your breath slowed down? your thoughts would have got reduced now. Hands at the back, grab your opposite elbows. Inhale, bend back. Exhale, bend forward. Send your gratitudes to the universal energy and be thankful to the Mother Earth. Slowly come up with an inhalation, release your hands, rub your palms nicely, generate the heat. Transfer this heat to that body part which you want to heal. Once again, rub your palms and this time, cup your eyes. Looking straight into your palms, gently open your eyes. Palms to the chest center. Namaste. Thank you so much for your practice. I hope you have practice enjoy kari hogi and agar complete kari hai starting se lekar end thak comment section mein done zarur lik dena. Soreness aap apni body mein expect kar sakte ho. So just keep yourself hydrated. To kal hai day 3 of our 10 day yoga journey of transformation Hatha Yoga. Tab tak take care, eat well, sleep well. Namaste.